No sign of Zorolja or that oversized lout. How much easier it would be if Soralja were to fail here. But that isn't likely to happen. Honored guests, I am Zanu Hali, elder of the Hanu. I am also an elector, charged with judging which among you is worthy of ascending the throne. Without further ado, let us talk of the feat. Not so fast. Surely you couldn't begin without us. Eh, you made it after all. No need to fuss. There is no time limit for this challenge. Now, if you would allow me to proceed. It is here, in Okanu, where my people forged a bond with the Dawn Servant during our own chapter of the Tuli Yolal Saga. In homage to those events, I have prepared for you the Feet of Reeds. Reeds seem to be of great importance to the Hanu. I wonder what this feat entails. We use reeds in every part of our lives, be it as food or weaving material. But look around the nearby paddies, and you will see that this season, our crops are failing. How fortunate, then, that my appointment to Elector coincided with this predicament. For surely, those who aspire to be Dawn Servant would find the matter of an ailing harvest a mere trifle to resolve. Aye, well, it is indeed the duty of a ruler to address the people's woes. <laughs> exactly, exactly! Do well in this, and you will earn my keystone. Why bother mucking about in the mud, when we can take the stone by force? Oh, mercy me! You are a hot-headed fellow, Bakul Jaja. Some electors may enjoy going toe-to-toe -to -toe with scrappers like you, but I refuse to entertain your base instincts. Arrangements have been made. Should you attempt to engage a feat giver in combat without their consent, word of your immediate disqualification will be sent to the palace. If you're still feeling feisty, then by all means, draw your weapon. <laughs> this contest is presided over by cowards. There's no sport in fighting you. Then we can return to the business of earning my keystone. The feat of reeds is begun. Claimants, I wish you the best of luck. Huh. The clever kitty crossed the seas to study foreign novelties. He might know tricks, we don't. What of Little Miss Mittens? <laughs> you know the answer to that. Compared to the first and second promise, she's a distant third. Not even in the running. Then we see eye to eye on this brother. Being Bakul Jaja so long with me has rubbed off on you. <laughs> These allies of hers, though, they might be a problem. Damn it! 
just as qualified to be here as they are. I'll show them. Easy now. There's no time limit, remember? Let's keep calm and think things through. Right. You're right. I won't win against that lumbering vidrol by losing my head. 